We're talking with new Indy 11 coach Jurgen Summer. Uh, coach, you're the coach of a team now with, with no players. What's the next step in assembling a roster for this new uh, NASL franchise? The next big important step for us is to reach out into the uh, variety of different communities here, uh, university programs like Indiana University, Notre Dame, IUPUI, Akron, Louisville, really look for the next generation of up-and-coming, you know, talented soccer players, as well as uh, looking into the current professional leagues of former Indiana players that are out, you know, honing their craft and would have interest in coming back home and being part of the, the growth of the Indy 11. Um, there's no shortage of interest from players uh, expressing interest in trying out for the team. I think for us, the process is uh, just finding the right fit and uh, the right chemistry team that we want to have and represent the Indy 11. I understand you're getting interest from players all over the world. Uh, Indianapolis must be seen as a desirable destination for some of these players. It really is. I, you know, I think the success of all the sporting events that have been hosted here in the city of Indianapolis, whether it's the Indy 500, NCAA basketball championships, Big Ten football championships, you know, the success of the Pacers and the Colts, uh, really is on the international stage. We have a terrific venue in Lucas Oil Stadium, and you know, hosting the Super Bowl uh, has definitely put Indianapolis on the map. And now we bring Chelsea Inter Milan to Indianapolis August the 1st, and that'll be a great celebration for soccer fans to have two storied European soccer clubs uh, play a match here in the city of Indianapolis. So uh, the, Indian, the, the international community is large and it's growing. In Indianapolis, and I think we're perfect timing to, to utilize that support.